Good morning and happy Sunday. Today is day four of my 30 day gratitude challenge. And today I am grateful for my mind. My mind keeps me wondering, thinking, and hoping and dreaming all the time. I thank God that my mind is still in its right place, is still intact. I still have my sanity. <laughs> Hallelujah. Um, I hope that one day as I grow older into an elderly person, that my mind is still as sharp as it is today. <laughs> it would be great. I've seen a lot of older people in their 70s and 80s and even their 90s still in their right mind, still sharp, very aware of their surroundings, very aware of the people that they know, still going, still driving. It's a blessing to have your mind. Um, it's a complex thing when you think about it. And you have to protect your mind at all times. In order to keep my sanity and my peace, I do a lot of reading. Sometimes I do a little bit of writing. And it's helped me a lot. It's really helped me a lot. And I'm just extremely grateful that my mind is unstoppable and nobody, and I mean nobody, can control my mind. <laughs> That's one thing I am proud to say, as one accomplishment I can say is nobody can control my mind no matter what, even if the situation is dire, nobody can control my mind. But yes, that is all I have for today. It's just my mind. I thank God every day that I am still aware of my surroundings. I'm still aware of the people that I know of. And I'm still conscious in my mind and I've actually gone deeper to the point where now it's more of a spiritual awakening when you think about it you definitely have that wake up call when you know you're about to break but you pray about it and then you snap back into reality <laughs> and you still have your mind and you still have your focus and you regain consciousness to the point where you know for sure that your mind is precious. It's just like the quote by um, Martin Luther King Jr. God rest his soul. A mind is a terrible thing to waste. So just think about that in this season. When you feel like giving up hope, you feel like giving up dreams. When you don't have a clear vision or a clear path of what you want to do in life. And you're struggling because you can't handle your mind. That's when you go seek help. You go seek therapy. You go seek counseling to take care of your mind because you definitely don't want to waste your mind. You definitely don't want to waste your mind. But um, that's pretty much it. Uh, you guys have a 
wonderful weekend. Hopefully, um, everyone's staying busy, staying healthy in their minds. And um, I just wish everyone the best of luck. God bless you. Take care. Bye-bye.